Well, as much as I want to wait and get this place established, and it is most of the way done, we just uh, I just got an alarm, essentially, that the house is under attack by a zombie horde. And I don't want to leave everyone there by themselves, so we're going to jog right up the street because it's not too far away. And there were no hordes super close. And see if we can help out a bit. We're going to go ahead and sprint this last bit. See how this goes. Looks like shots are getting fired up there. Zombie horde alerted. Okay, where are they at? Oh, here's one. Climbing over. Oh, they're all over the place, aren't they? Ugh, let's get in this. <laughs> get out of our home. <laughs> okay, is there more? Or did I get here just in time to kill the last few? Looks like we're doing pretty well. Let's see. Oh, there's one. I was like, I think there's one nearby. I am getting exhausted, too. Dominic needs a break. Whoo! They shot him right in the head. Let's see, one here somewhere? There we go. Yeah, keep shooting. Oh man. There we go. What else we got? Nothing? Is that... Are we good? I think we might be good. Ooh. You got it? <laughs> She's crawling. Finish her off there. Oh, another one. There, there you go. Oh, Dominic led the way. Nice. I came in and just dove in on it. Okay, we are clear. Very cool. Now, we can see on the map here we've got the outpost. The interesting thing is there's now a... There's now a person there. <laughs> I didn't give anybody permission to go there yet. Okay, so anyway, I think what we'll do is we'll cruise back there. We're going to find out who's here. And we do have an indicator that says the... I think that's actually this. No, that's... A transmission so we could look into that on the way over now of course Dominic is exhausted so I should probably switch him out um, let's see here we could switch out with Sam but I'd actually rather switch out with Marcus um, if we can find him where are you at Marcus you inside taking a break I see the pastor but no Marcus let's go in here and switch him out if we can find him you're there. You're just hanging there with that bag over your shoulder. Can't relax enough to put it down. Huh. I'm not seeing Marcus again. He's stealthy. Like a ninja. Is he not here? Oh, there he is. Totally missed him. What's up, Marcus? You need to take over for me. Sweet. Been a while since we ran with Marcus. So we're going to have him go check out that transmission, which is just ahead and over the wall. And it happens to be on the way to our new outpost, so we can then investigate what it takes to move everybody. Cruise right down here. We do have some zombies. I'm hearing them. Are they following me, though? That's a question. No. Okay, we've got a mess of them outside. I think what we're going to do is try the back door. You know what? I should have checked his gear. That was stupid, wasn't it? Okay, he's got the machete equipped, and he's got the club, the golf club, as a backup. Sweet. Thinking ahead. Okay, we've got... We don't want to bust in any windows. It's way too loud. Back door is open, so that makes this easy. Now we'll be quiet about this. Oh. Oh, well, it wasn't zombies out front. Uncle Sam would seem to disagree with you there. Our orders are to evict squatters with lethal force if they resist. You resisted, so. Just let us go. I have a feeling zombies are going to come join us here in a minute. And yet you're out here, violating quarantine, unlawfully occupied. I can't move, unfortunately. Great, Barry. Spin my view. Okay, let's go. I can't move still. 
I think I might need to run as well. We're done here, Sergeant. Tell your men to prep for evac and RTB. Yes, <laughs> Now what happens to me? Is he talking to me? I think he might be talking to me. Let's go see what these guys have to say. No? You're not going to talk to me? You aren't going to talk to me. How about you? No? Okay, well, they told me to go chase after those two. Uh, hmm. Let's see, are they on my map? We got the question marks here. Let's see. So they scattered somewhere over there. Well, you know what? I really want to find out whether our place is set. Actually, it should be. More accurately, I guess I want to find out what it takes to move camps. So I'm a little disappointed. I've actually was reading a bit about the DLC that's coming, and I thought the next DLC that was coming would be the Sandbox DLC. And as it turns out, that is not the case. The next one coming uh, increases the difficulty. I think it it does it does a number of things except add the sandbox mode, so it's kind of a bummer. Um, it looks like they've been working on the keyboard controls. I did see a post saying that some of that is in a little bit, but I've actually been cool with the uh, controller, so I'm really not concerned about that. Okay, so we've got her hanging out here. We're gonna get with her in a second. Um, now, we've already established this as an outpost, so I don't know why that's now an option to me again. Huh. I shouldn't be able to do that again. I guess I could try. Yeah, I think we could hold this place. We can't manage another outpost. Whatever you say. Okay. We've but it is it's an outpost, so Anyway, I guess it's confused. <laughs> I guess it's confused about being an outpost anyway. We should be established. The thing went through. And, and maybe I'm wrong. Maybe you can only have, uh, you know, maybe these are outposts and this one is not. I don't know. I'm a little confused myself. So anyway, let's see what this Maggie character has to say for herself. Or not. I guess she doesn't want to talk to me. Hmm. Okay, Maggie, you sit there silently then. Uh, let's see, so we could go after those survivors. Um, I think what we might do is uh, we could go to one of these and, and take it down as an outpost. Um, outpost 4, why does it say that? Oh, you know what? Let me back this out. Did I establish anything down here? Okay, so I set this up as a third outpost. You can even see it says outpost 3. This one says outpost 4. So I don't know why it's giving me the option to make this an outpost again. It should be grayed out, I would think. But And I would love to move people here, but it's not letting me do that. I'm going to have to do some research on that, that's for sure. Well, according to what I looked at, I should be able to establish this as a new home. It says that we need uh, some materials. I think it was 30 materials, which we have plenty of and we would need eight people and we have 10. So some of the places require 12 people. Uh, I think for now we're just gonna let it go. Something may be going on is there's a woman in there and I can't talk to her. She won't listen to reason. No, she just actually, I can't interact with her at all. I walk up and hit Y and she says nothing. Whoops, where are you at? Where are you at? There you are. I'm making him double fence hop. Come on. You can do, there you go. There you go, that wasn't that hard. Another one, another one. Oh, you're good. So anyway, we'll get back to that later. That's something that we'll have to, uh, maybe in, maybe next time we restart, we'll check it out again. For now, I'm gonna kind of move in this direction and we're gonna look for those survivors and we'll, we'll pick them up if we can, if we could find them pretty quickly. So we're gonna jog over here and see if they happen to be in this place. Up over here. I'm gonna wait a second and make sure none of these guys followed. I see him laying on the ground. He's a marker on my mini map. Looks okay though, so let's go ahead and go in here slowly. Anybody in here? This is kind of a, a dead end, I suppose. Just a little closet area. 
to go around to the front. Let's try this door. Whoa! It's a restroom, it seems. Let's see. Hey, come here. I can't open this, I guess. Okay, well, nobody in here. Nothing in here, nothing to see. After having played Project Zomboid, I'm wanting to search the backpack and the garbage can. <laughs> None of that here. Okay, let's try the men's restroom. Of course, we have to bust it open. Better look. Consider this one searched. <laughs> cool. Okay, now I see a white dot just appeared over here. What was that? Oh, it's just a zombie. I guess he's red because I, I hadn't drawn his attention yet. And now I have. <laughs> That's okay. We're going to keep heading in this direction. We'll let him catch up. So, let's see. We've got a number of potential houses here. This being the next one. We do have the zombie horde coming down the front street. And the zombie behind me has decided not to follow, so... Let's go in here if we can. A little shed back here they could be in. Looks like an Anybody home? Time to move on. Okay, there's a horde out there. We're gonna let them pass while we search this though. Spin my view around. Ooh, infestation nearby. It's no good. Sounds terrible. Okay, let's check this place out. Hello? Any survivors? Oh shit. I mean, shoot. <laughs> Startled me. Anybody in here? No? Zombies. There's all kinds of resources here. Look at the horde walking by out there. <laughs> like any other busy street. Can I take any of this? No? See all these medical supplies. Oh, look at that. Okay, so we could load a rucksack from here. Not a bad idea, um, I, but I think we'll come back to that. We, it's really not what we're here for. Um, prefer to find survivors. Hmm. I don't like the music. I don't like the way it's ramping up. I'm hearing something in here. Oh crap. Oh crap. Oh no. They're coming for this place like crazy. Oh no, get out. I can't run fast. Oh. Get. Go! Get out! <laughs> Run! <laughs> oh, that was freaky. The whole horde was running at me. Oh, boy. <laughs> it was just like a swarm just ran at the house. Oh, crap. Alright, well, <laughs> we're going to abort that mission. Those guys are on their own for now. <laughs> we have places to be, and those places are not here. Not here at all. Okay, I ran away and took a break for a bit, but now I'm heading back because, as the game reminded me, there is no saving. No saving if you're in the middle of a mission. You will lose your progress. So we are going to head back this direction and check this house now. And if I feel like we get a shot, then maybe I'll go back across the street and risk the horde once again, risk the infestation because I didn't fully get to check that place out down you go let's clear this place alright, I think we've got more, I hear more there you are
I definitely saw something I can search. This guy here. Might as well do that. Come on, big money. <laughs> a pistol, sure. Ooh, and a large backpack. I was actually just thinking of this, too. I thought, man, if I had a large backpack, because some of the other characters are still using small backpacks, so that's definitely going to come in handy. I'm not seeing any other survivors. So, of course, they're going to be in the house next to the infestation, right? And we're going to take this guy out. There's a guy right here. I think he just hopped the fence, actually. Yeah, there he is. He kind of didn't hop the fence. One more. One more. <laughs> okay. Well, what we're left with is the house with the infestation for a backyard. Unfortunately. I think that's the only one we have left. Let's see. No, there is another one, but it also has the infestation in its backyard. Until we've cleared this, though... I don't want to ditch it, so we're going to try this again. Certainly a zombie right inside the door. Here she comes. Okay, what else we got? Oh, crap. Get off of me. <laughs> Turn around. Oh, more. Turn around. <laughs> Let me get tired here real quick. Whew. So many places to check. I guess I didn't get credit for what I already checked before in here. Unfortunately. I think we'll be a little bit better this time, though. Last time it was like the horde came running like a crazed pack of animals. Two more spots here. Consider this one search. Cool. So let's go ahead and step outside. Try to avoid that infestation. We're going to go around it a little bit. My machete is on the brink. That house is packed full. <laughs> I might need to switch now so that it's not a um, it's not a problem later. Let's just go ahead and switch over to the club. Yes, that's all I have, right? Hey, that's not what I wanted. It's not what I wanted. There we go. That way I'm not trying to switch my weapon around in the middle of a frantic fight. I hear them, but I don't see them. Okay, let's just hop on in here. There he is. Is he going to leave us alone? I think so. Okay, cool. I have not been over this direction before. And we do have to pass awfully close to that infested house. Front door's open. Let's do this. They have to be here, right? Uh, there are no other places, at least with a question mark, so... Ah, hello. Anybody in here? <laughs> uh, yeah, right here. <laughs> Why don't you come with me? We've got room. Really? Thank you. <laughs> I thought for sure we were gonna die out here. I thought we was gonna die. How about you? Anything to say? No? Well, it says this place is pretty cleared out, so... Let's go out of here and we're gonna move away from the infestation. <laughs> it's a pretty straight shot, too. I see this zombie. We may have drawn his attention. Or not. Maybe he'll just hang out there. Oh, we got his attention. Can you guys do something? Here. Yeah, handle him. Nice! Frying pad to the dome. <laughs> Combo attack there. I see. You hold and she hits him with a frying pan. Oh, crap. You good? <laughs> nice, we both have golf clubs. Hmm. Whoops. 
Montresor. It's an interesting name. Well, you'll be safe here for the most part, sort of. <laughs> That's it, right up there. Make yourselves at home. Thanks. Look at that, our morale is up quite a bit. I like it. So we do have a feral sighting. Let's take a peek. Um cool. Reputation improved, community fame. Excellent. Excellent. Things are looking up. I definitely like that the morale went up. That was really kind of scaring me. It was getting low. Now, one of the next things we need to address is that our food is quite low. So I think what we'll have to do is go out and find a place. Uh, we can see that this has got that. So we need to establish a, an outpost for food. We may have to drop something else. We have one here, though. Hmm. That is interesting. I'm sure I can go pick up food, too. Rucksack style, bring it back and give us a little bit of a surplus hopefully well I was considering what we could do for food and uh, medical supplies and we just got a transmission that somebody's needing help out over here now obviously we have kind of an infestation in between here and there so I'm thinking I'll kind of run up the street and then just head north from there but um, as much as I would rather be focusing on getting food and supplies medical supplies this isn't too far away so we're gonna make the jog out there we're not gonna take a car little uh... little too noisy and of course we do it looks like we have a horde up here and they are turning down the street though fortunately so if we kinda go this direction we should be able to avoid them and hopefully avoid the infestation to the right this is a house I have not explored either but um, I think we'll head straight for the mission these people that need help it seems as though when I get distracted and doing other things I miss out on the missions so I fail them unfortunately I should have brought another weapon with me definitely should have brought another weapon with me <laughs> I may even turn back because I have a feeling this thing could go down and then we'd be in some real trouble. Oh, jeez. Just bit me bad. Bit me bad. Well, I'm kind of busy right now. <laughs> Let's keep going. So we're already halfway there, so... I want to turn around now. I did just use my one medicine. And again, if I lose this weapon, then I'm out. Completely out of weapon. But I think we're just going to cruise up here and see how it goes. We got a little gap we can run between there. I don't know that I could climb up those rocks, though. So, we continue around this way. It'd be nice to drive a car right about now. I'd be over there so quick. But I would draw all of that attention. A little gap here. And there is a zombie horde. Let's see. Uh, I can run across their path if I go this way maybe. Go around them a bit and try to cross over before they come down this road. Should be right up there. There they are. Or at least I think that's what I just saw. That would have been fun. I would have drove the car right into them. Okay, where are we at here? I see all kinds of zombies here. So, rather than go up the middle, I think what we'll do is just head straight for one of them. Actually, we may be able to get around these guys. Crap. We get real close to that horde, though. Oh, there's one right here. Huh, stay down. Oh, see, this thing's already r damaged. Try to take it one swing at a time. I should be ninjing through here because I could kind of creep up behind him and one-shot him. 
Jeez, die already. <laughs> and, you know, I could probably sit there and swing, too. I guess I'm afraid that each swing, though, can ruin the durability. Um, oh, boy. That looks like a lot of activity. That is not what I want to get in the middle of. Zombie horde? Not at all what I want to get into, but... Whoops. And I'm terrible at aiming with a controller. I'm just kind of firing into the crowd. Circle around here. I'm so bad at aiming. Leave him alone! <laughs> I'm not sure I'm doing a whole lot here. <laughs> Who's coming up behind me? Who's coming up behind me? I see you. <laughs> there we go. Okay, well... I think I'm just about out of bullets here. Hey, see, he's got it. He doesn't need me. He doesn't need me at all. You handled that whole crew while I fired randomly into the crowd. I think you're fine. Dominic, what's he doing up here? I thought it was going to be a new guy. It did say help one of our own, but seriously. And now he took off somewhere. Where is he going? I hope he's trying to get home. Yeah, I think he's like training them back to the back to the house, <laughs> which is great cuz now I've got to run through them. <laughs> Just follow the zombies that are running. I'm guessing I helped him. We're we're gonna we're gonna say that I actually came, and helped, and um, he better go along with that. That's all I'm saying. I'm try to put some distance here, without killing all my stamina. There you are. Would you call me all the way out here for? You were just fine. Boy, you are running awfully close to this infected house. And there's a whole horde right there. Excellent. Let's go ahead and just run everybody back to the church. <laughs> Get over here. Why are you running so far over there? Oh, this is going to be bad. Oh, great. Yep, we just totally alert. Well, you're on your own, man. I don't have to be fast. I just have to be faster than you. <laughs> oh, boy. He's trying. I don't know. Maybe I should stop. Let's see. <laughs> we might lose him. Crap. Oh. oh, man. That's bad. Let's see if we can help. Nice! That was kind of awesome. Get off of him. Oh, this is bad. <laughs> can we take a whole horde by ourselves? I'm about to lose my club, that's for sure. Crap. Man, you're killing me here, man. <laughs> now he's saying it. I only have to be faster than you. Crap. Ugh, there we go. Sprint it. Well, that's cool. We took out a horde. I'm kind of surprised. That didn't look very good. He went down. I thought he was down, down. Whew. Made it back. Exhausted, but alive. Look at that morale. Very nice. Okay, well, mission accomplished. Like I said, I didn't know that was going to be Dominic. I thought it might be a new person, but I guess it makes sense when she said it was our people. I wasn't aware that they would run off and do their own missions, so I thought that if I came back here, everybody would be available to talk to, but apparently that's not always the case.